Good morning again and welcome to another morning devotion. And we are back at Psalm 100 verse 5. And it's the second movement. For the Lord is good. His mercy is everlasting. And you know at times God allows some things to happen in our lives. When we look back, we conclude Wow, if it were not for the mercies of God, we would not make it. In Genesis 39, verse 21, the Bible says God remembered Joseph and showed him mercy. And Joseph was falsely accused, but God allowed it. Instead, he showed him mercy. God wants the glory, hallelujah. We're in this pandemic and God has allowed again for his glory. God could have stopped it. I mean, what law, what government, what civil society, what church can stop God because he's sovereign. He does what he chooses, when he chooses, but he does it for his glory. Would we say while we're in this pandemic, while we're in these emergency order lockdown on weekends, would we say thank you, Lord, for your mercy, for the glory belongs to you? Would we complain? Would we criticize? God allows certain things in our lives so that his mercy can be experienced and more importantly, that he receives the glory. Would you give God glory today because of his mercy? It's new every morning. We don't have to ask for it. We don't have to petition God for it. He gives us it every morning brand new. Thank you, Father, for your mercy today that will keep me for all that you may allow to happen. But that I will complain. Forgive us for complaining. Forgive us for murmuring. Yes, we're falsely accused. And some of us are rightfully accused. But nevertheless, we cry out of mercy upon us and we thank you. We bless your name. We bring our medical professionals, the frontliners, Everyone who's out there fighting, serving, doing in this pandemic, we give you praise. May they thank you for your mercy, for it endures forever. We pray for our governments, those who lead our prime minister. God, that they may pause even in their briefings and declare the mercies of God endures forever. And they give me thanks. I pray. For us, the body of Christ, you want to manifest in us. You want to show yourself strong in us. May we declare, thank God for his mercy. It endures forever. We give you all praise as we seek your forgiveness. As we forgive those who wronged us, oh God. And that we will decide from this day forward, we will do what is right and righteous. For yours is the kingdom. Heal those that are sick, that are afflicted. Come for those that have lost loved ones, God. May we look to you, God. We are mercy in God's forever. We give you thanks in Jesus' name. Amen. So as you devote with your family today, as you serve God in prayer, worship, just remember his mercy is everlasting. God bless you.